p.m. Rock and Pop Mandolin, your site for learning classic rock and pop songs on this wonderful little eight-stringed instrument. My name is Mike DeJong, and this time we're taking you back to the early 1990s and another classic hit from that classic band, The Cure. This one is called Friday, I'm in Love. And a really nice song to play on the mandolin because there's some nice electric guitars, 12-string electric guitars, that are played in the original track that kind of sound like a mandolin, so that opening lick sounds uh, pretty cool on this little instrument. But before we get to that, a little bit of business. If you're new here, thanks for checking out the channel. We really appreciate it. But don't forget to hit that little red subscriber button on your way out. If you are a returning subscriber, well, we've got a host of things for you to check out that might be able to support this channel a little bit if you like the work I do. Check out the description box below. You'll find a link there or just below that for my new series of merchandise. That's right, you can get Rock and Pop Mandolin merch down there, including a newly designed logo, which will be uh, coming out early in 2023. And you can get t-shirts and hoodies and all types of things down there. Also, down in the description box, you'll find links to my uh, Sweetwater and Amazon affiliates, a link to the Johansson Mandolin site, where you can get one of these great instruments from Ross Johansson. And finally, you can join our Patreon team down there. Yes, you can join Patreon and get access to tabs for many of the songs that are appearing on this channel. I'll be adding those tabs as we go in the coming months. Many of you guys have been asking for tabs, so there you go. Join Patreon and you can find them. And finally, there's a link to my Learn Rock and Pop Mandolin lessons down below. If you are a beginner or an intermediate player and really want to improve quickly, that is your avenue to do it. 16 lessons taking you right from the start up to intermediate level. Learn Rock and Pop Mandolin video lessons with me, Mike DeJong. The link is down below. That's enough business for now. Let's take a look at this Cure song called Friday I'm in Love mandolin version here on RPM. Okay, this song is in the key of D and starts off with a really cool little guitar lick that I can mimic here on the mandolin. Now, I'm not getting it exactly correct, but it's close enough and I think it sounds pretty good. So it goes like this. Okay, so what you're doing there is you're hitting that open G string and letting that ring out while playing that little lick on the D string. So it's kind of working together like a double stop there. And it kind of mimics the original lick in the uh, Cure's uh, original version of this song on the guitar. So it goes. So you're going open G, open D, like that. And then, so open D, two, four, two, open. So open and two again. So open, open, two, four, two, open, two. Okay, then the next part of the lick goes like this. And now if you want, you can drone this open D string as well to give you another double stop sound. You don't have to, but it sounds pretty cool if you do this. Can you hear that? I'm hitting both of those strings together, the, the middle two strings. So this lick goes, you're just using two, four, and open mainly here, right? Okay. Just like that. Follow my fingers there. Right? And I'm hitting both those strings, ending up with that open, those two open strings right there, the D and the A. Now, I'm using all down strokes for this lick right here. Everything, right from the start. Right? All of those are down strokes because you really want that sort of staccato, choppy attack with this lick. So, right? And then again. All right, next you do almost the same thing. You go, right, that part. Again, two, four, two, four, like that. But now you're going to jump up to that A string for that little pattern. All right? So, your A, open A five, four, two. So once again, that's the first part. Now he, here to the A. Okay, one more time slowly. I'll do it right from the start. Right? All right, and that's the first part of the lick. All right, so once you come off that, you do it again. 
You do that part again, so again it's to those two open strings, and now you're going to finish off. You're going, you're going down actually in sound, but up on the mandolin, so so that's open D to that two on the G, and then to the four, like that. All right, so one more time slowly from the beginning. Right? Now here. And when you hit that, those two strings can ring out together again because they form part of that D chord, right? So, and then when you end, you can end like that with those two strings right there, the uh, second fret of the G and the open D. All right, so that is the opening lick to this song. Okay, next you're into the verses and the chords are D, G, D, A, B minor, G, D, A. All right, with a few little embellishments that I'll show you, all right? Mandolin style embellishments. So the chord strumming goes, So what is that? Well, just D. And now I'm using a combination of down and up strokes, all right? So down, down. So down, 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 up. Down, 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 up. Down, 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 up. All right, so you're going D chord. All right, your D is the second fret here and second fret down there. Middle two strings open to your standard G chord, which is second fret here of the A, third fret of the E. So... D to the G, now D to A. And I'm using this A voicing here, which you can also play with one finger if you like, but I like using that voicing there, which is second fret and second fret, and open, open, all right, like that. So once again, D, G, D, A. Okay, now while you're playing those chords, you can also put in some mandolin embellishments, as I mentioned before. Um, these are a little bit different from what the original uh, guitarist does in the Cure on the original version, but they work nicely for the mandolin. So what I'm doing here is I'm going... Again, I'm just pulling that first finger off and giving a little bit of a G sus chord there, so... And I'm doing the same thing with the A. And that's why I like doing it with these two fingers, making that chord with these two fingers, because you can pull that off and get a get an A sus4 chord. So here, D, G, sus, D, A, sus, like that. All right, now you're moving to this chord, which is a B minor chord, all right? Same strumming pattern now. B minor, it's the fourth fret here, fourth fret, fifth fret, four, four, five. You can also play it like this if you like. That's another B minor voicing, but I prefer this one here. So you're going from B minor to G, and then D to A. Okay, I'll show you once again. I'll start from the beginning of the chords. D, G, D, A, B minor, G, D, A. And that is the verse pattern for this song. All right, next is a little pre-chorus, or chorus, whatever you want to call it. it goes, Saturday waits, Sunday always comes too late. Okay, so what is he doing there? Well, he's going G, A, B minor, G, D, A. All right, one more time, that's... And that's kind of the pre-chorus or chorus part of this song. All right, and basically the only part left of this song is a little bridge part, which goes...
Okay, so what is that? Well, that's that B minor chord once again. And then I'm going to a C and a D, and then down to an A chord. All right, so B minor, once again, fourth fret, fourth fret, five. Then I'm just sliding that up one fret to here. And now I'm going five, five, seven. So that's a C chord. I'm not bothering with the, the highest note here. So just like that. And then I'm sliding that configuration, that voicing up two frets to here, which makes it a D chord. All right, so that's seven, seven, nine. And then I'm sliding all the way down to A. And I like to do it with my pinky here, but you can do it with your third finger as well if you, sli if you like. So that's second, second, and fourth. So one more time. Okay, and it's B minor, C, D, A, and so on. It goes like that. So B minor, C, D, A. Of course, you can play other voicings of those chords if you like. But I like the ascending nature of those ones there. It sounds more like the original track to have that, that root note there, the B, the C, and the D um, ascending or ascending, and then going down to this A chord down here. All right, that is it. That is The Cure's Friday I'm In Love, a pretty simple song for the most part, except for that opening lick, but that is not too tricky. You should be able to get it on the mandolin, and it's a lot of fun with those open, droning, uh, double-stop string. Sounds really cool. Thanks very much for tuning into this lesson. We really appreciate it. And if you're new here, don't forget to hit that little red subscriber button. If you are not new here, check out all of the possibilities to support the channel down below in the description box. My name is Mike DeJong. Thanks once again for tuning in to RPM.